YouTube, it's Herbie with Half of My Autos. We back with another video. I know I didn't shoot a video in a very long time, but it's been so much going on. And today I'm gonna pick up a personal car. It's a, it's a little favorite of mine, and I've been waiting a long time to get this car and find it for the right price, a cheap price, to just hook it up and go crazy. So let's go into Copart right now. We're in Copart, Trenton, New Jersey, and we're gonna pay for this car. Sight unseen, G37X. Who is hot in here? Hey, what's up, y'all? So, I didn't have my camera at first, so I was shooting on the iPhone. I picked up my camera for the second day. I made it home fine, and this is the second day. Peace. Hey, what's going on, you guys? It's day two of the G37 project that I picked up um, right now. Um, today, I might take the headliner off because I think somebody was smoking in here and it got a little dirty. So, I think I'm going to drop that, and I ordered some suede for the roof. Right now, I'm on my way to the exhaust shop to fix the exhaust on the car. Um, but so far, so good. I think I need to change like the camshaft position sensor because it has like a slip EVC light that I was reading about, and um, also a camshaft code. Make one, and it drives perfectly fine. Um, right now, I'm just going to fix the exhaust because it has like a leak in the exhaust. What else? I have to charge the AC up also because the AC is type hot. Um, this is just the progress and the process of just buying a used um, car. Um, I ordered the wrap for it, so if you guys can guess what color I ordered, comment below what, what color you think I ordered for this G37. Um, what else? Um, the wrap came in yesterday for the black roof to black out the roof uh, from Cheetah Wrap. Shout out to Cheetah Wrap uh, for fellas. And also, so that's so far so good. Everything is good. I ordered so much stuff for it. I'm waiting on it to come down. But the first thing I'm gonna do is just get it uh, mechanically running well, and then I just take it from there. It has a few lights, but I wiped it down a little bit. Not too much, cause the person that had it before probably was smoking like a heavy smoker, and it's just like you can smell it smoke residue in the car so i'm gonna shampoo the rugs and um pull the seats out i might pull them all out today if i have time i'm just not sure yet I'm not sure what i'm gonna do today if i can get time to do everything that'll be perfect i'll show you guys in a second how it looks got the muffler 
Muffin Shop. So I'll see you guys at the Muffin Shop. Peace. So right now I'm getting the Wi Fi cut off of the uh, 37. And I'm just going to fit two straight pads going straight to the back of the um, exhaust. I'm going to show you guys. So I'm going to let him work. And I'll see you guys in a second. Got my boy pulling up, bringing his other G35 to fix the exhaust on it. Hey, what's going on, y'all? So, right now, we're gonna take the headliner off. We already took these two side trims off. Um, we removed the side trims. The black Alicantara suede came in, like a suede Alicantara look. So I have a big piece of this, hopefully, and take that gray nasty color away. But so far, so good. So we get to work. So now we just finished taking out all the seats and we finished taking out most of the trim. And now we're up to, this is what we're up to so far. It hasn't been that long, probably like an hour. Took all the seats out, all the seats right here. We put it in boxes and stuff like that. Um, just to scrub it, cause whoever had this before was a heavy smoker. Cigarette butt I found on the ground outside. You know, some might say it's not safe, but you know, smoking cigarettes is not safe. So who's really the dumb one? Just gonna try this shit for the one time. So we got everything out. Now we're up to these parts. Um, we're trying to figure out how to get these handles off the proper way without breaking anything. And just this um, center piece. And everything's so good so far. We stripped out most of these. Um, so we can go with the black. So this is our progress so far, guys. I let you know when we finish. We might not. We're not doing anything more than just um, stripping it tonight. It's real late, so we're just gonna strip it and then go from there. What you mean? Like what? Yeah, I don't want to piece of thing. So, so try to yeah. There might be some clips. Ouch. Damn. I should hit my elbow. So now we got this down completely. Oh, so this didn't connect to wires? What's going on? Alright, so now we're going to lean it. What's those wires up there? Loose? Is that got wires? No, I don't think it got wires. So how can we get another no, no, home? Let me get up. Alright. So we just finished pulling this out. Look how dirty it was. Now we're gonna just vacuum it out. Clean the garbage out. Let's get it going. G37 rebuild. See the little dents? <clears throat> working, working. Hey, what's going on guys? We're back with another video. So this is second, well, second or third day. We're working on this G37 and now we got the roof down. Well, the um, interior roof, um, roof, uh, what you call that? 
Um, the roof line it down. I got this perfect suede uh, imitation of Alcantara that we're gonna put on the top. It's just enough. And I have also this Gorilla adhesive, heavy duty spray. So right now we're gonna get into it and basically wrap the headliner of the car black and get that nasty headliner that was on there off. So now I'm working on this. This is the progress from last night. All the seats, everything out. Whole car gutted. So far, so good. Um, I just took all these clips off this side. I'm letting a few more dry before I work on the inner sunroof. Uh, the headliner. This one I put uh, the handle back on and I just stuck some glue in it. For t wait till these fenders come in so I can change the fenders before I wrap it. The door is a little dented also. I'm going to figure out what I'm going to do with that. But now it's time for me to clean up and get out of here. See you guys next time on the next G37 video. Peace. Hey, what's going on YouTube? I'm back with another video about the G37X that I purchased. Um, it's me and my boy Diz here once again. He's here working. Basically, we got this in and we are putting on the fender. Um, so we got a fender right here, this door. I pulled out a little bit of the damage that was on the door. Uh, what else? It's a little damage right there. So right now, a little damage right here. So right now, this is the steps that we are at. Wrap the um, the mirrors, wrap the roof already, and also I also wrapped the interior headliner. Black suede came out beautiful. So now, and I also steam cleaned the seats. So the seats are steam clean. So that's what it is so far. So far today, we're gonna try to just knock out the color on the roof to do this color change uh, i'm not going to tell you guys what color it is yet so be prepared and i know you guys see that rv in the back right yeah i've been neglecting the rv but i'm gonna have to get to it one of these days so we just picked up this vinyl oh oh man i don't want to show the color i think they seen the color no, i don't know let me check bro all right so all right, so we're going to just reveal the color because you guys already got a sneak peek. So just open it up, this. We got a razor. Let's, we bought some new razors. Okay. Open it up. Sneak peek of the new color that's about to get done on this G37X. Let me try to, me try to open this razor. So this is going to open it up. Let's check out this color. Now you guys can see a little sneaky. Alright, let's see. 
Alright, the oh, paper coming off. Nice, bro. The paper coming off. Oh, shit. Oh, hold on. I'm not going to show you guys. I'm not going to show you guys. <laughs> oh, yo. Alright, let me help this you. This looks so dope. Alright, so hold on. I think we should open it from the bottom because the bottom is where the stand is at, I think. So, oh, yeah, right. we can just pull it from the bottom. Bottom up? Yeah. Alright, so now just let it... Let's see if it's... Let's see if there's more tape on there. Slice that side. Let it slide out. Slice the other side. Got it? Oh. Yeah, right, go. cool. Ooh right, pull it up. Wow. Oh my god. This is not. Yo, it has a rainbow weird finish to it at some point. Let me see if I can focus the camera. I don't know if I can focus it. Oh, that's beautiful though. That color is crazy. I don't know, it's like this camera's not doing justice, but it's like a white pearl. So we're gonna get to doing the hood, and I'll catch you guys in a second. Peace. It has a protector too. Oh, for real? I just never seen that. Yeah, look. Cheese, look. No, it's not, it's not. Hold it up, stay there. I'm gonna push the wrap. Stay still. Oh, I see. Oh, that's nice. It's like a, it's a milky consistency with a blue pearl. That shit is nice, bro. Now all we gotta do is heat up the edges, right? Get it nice and brown. Alright, let's see. 
Hey guys, so we just did the first step. We did the white gloss pearl from Vivid, and now we're gonna just put everything together, get these corners together, make sure it looks like paint. And this is our first time working with like a gloss pearl like this. And it's just practice makes perfect. A few spots we see that when you stretch it, like right here, it gets a little dull and the shine starts like going away from it. But for the most part, it's so good and it looks so good for us for not being professionals and we just messing around. Looks good, looks good. So we're gonna continue to uh, wrap some more pieces. I'm not sure what's next, but keep you guys posted. That is what they all say when they see me pouring some oil. 